Here's everything that's gone wrong with Cybertruck so far. Hey, I'm Andrea Guzman, Kron's Texas Brands reporter. After years of waiting, some owners have noticed a lot of issues with their Cybertrucks. First, it's actual release. Those who placed orders for a Cybertruck waited quite a while before finally getting it. First announced in 2019, Tesla planned to start production in 2021, then delayed until 2022, and finally began delivering vehicles in 2023. As the rollout loomed, Cybertruck buyers found that they would be cornered into keeping the vehicle that runs a price tag of about $80,000. The Terms and Conditions document for purchasing a Tesla vehicle has a Cybertruck-only clause, noting that the Austin-based car maker can sue buyers for $50,000 or more if they resell their Cybertruck during the first year of ownership. Once Cybertruck owners got the vehicles, complaints have come out that the stainless steel vehicle rusts and the panels are misaligned. Outside of cosmetic features, the front trunk is really great at slicing vegetables and possibly your fingers if you're in the wrong place at the wrong time. All things aside, the truck can at least go off-roading, except for when it gets stuck in a national forest like it did this past December.